Hi everybody, my name is Brandon Fleming and these are jokes that I have wrote for entertainment purposes only. My family and I have a fun relationship. We all like to pick on each other and that's okay. My sister, she has this video of me, it's embarrassing, of me like lifting up my shirt and showing off my stretch marks. And that's okay because I've been keeping the secret that her husband has been cheating on her for the last seven years. Okay, ready? You ready for a joke? I am. I always felt like I was pretty stupid. All the way up until last year, I used to think that buses and school buses were stopping on the railroad tracks to look both ways. <laughs> That's completely true. And I, was, I got on my soapbox and I was like, how stupid is this? And the person I was with was like, how stupid are you? <laughs> no, but I definitely feel like I have like a learning curve. Because, you know, after years of trying to write comedy, play video games, work mundane jobs. My brain still thinks it's a good idea to try taking a whack at being a musician. It's like it's too late now, you know. You either either learn piano as a young Asian toddler or you don't learn it at all. <laughs> you know, we live in a very sensitive time. I remember back in the day when mooning someone was just a playful way to commit a sexual offense. Now it's just a regular sexual offense. Anyway, I need a lawyer, so... Growing up, I had this real big obsession with wanting to be liked, and I remember I would like always ask people if they liked me and stuff, and they never really answered, not even the teachers, so like it kind of made sense because I had this reputation. I was like the boy that cried wolf, except there were no wolves involved, and I was just the boy that cried all the time. Mustaches have always been kind of funny to me, uh, especially growing up. I was fascinated with like drawing mustaches on magazines and newspaper faces that I'd find. A lot of my friends were obsessed with mustaches too. It was all funny. And it all seems fun and innocent until you grow up and realize that most pedophiles have mustaches. That's why I have a beard. You know, I'm going bald, so I need to have a beard because without it, it looks like I'm not allowed near schools. And I really need to be around schools so I can kidnap children. Growing up, you hear this term I always felt like it was a little exaggerative. It's like, is it worth losing your life over? Commonly associated with people like who have road rage and stuff like that. And I just feel like it's excessive and it's not needed. Unless you're born a honeybee. Then it's very important. I don't think I'd ever be a good inventor because I would just decide if something is a good invention or not, just if it rhymed. Like introducing the new Glock clock. I think it would stop any kind of mugging. Like someone comes up to you in an alley and says, hey, you've got the time. So yeah, sure, let me check. It's three. And then he'd probably run. Thank you everybody for watching, listening, or doing whatever you did with your eyes when you clicked on the video or if someone was already playing the video and you were just watching. My name is Brandon Fleming. As I said, this is a YouTube channel. Um, keep watching it. That helps. I think. Stop. <laughs> Hi, everybody. My name is Brandon Fleming, and these are some jokes that I wrote. That's a good opener. You like that? That's a good opener, yeah. Are you moving it? Oh, you just killed the entire thing. Oh, yeah, because you're going you're gonna to un do an uncut. I am going to do an uncut. It seems dark on those because every time you put your head down. It messes things up? It goes from lighter to darker. Mm. I can't fix that. I tried. It's probably oh. it's just because of the lighting behind You're me. either Jesus or Satan, dude. I can't get it in between. Well, see, that really affects the video. I don't think that would be a very good inventor because I would decide on something's good or not if it just rhymed. Like, we should make a Glock clock because it'll stop all the muggings. Someone comes up to you and says, hey, you know what time it is? I don't know. Let me check. <laughs> it's a gun.